Hey guys, what's up? This is Jeremy at Church Design Co. And I'm here working on a site for Pastor Cornell at Metro Assembly of God in Ohio. Um, he just purchased the simple template and we're working on setting up the online messages. So you can see here, um, when you go to the message page, you have all the sermons right here. You can click on one. You can go deeper in here and you can see we have like a basic page structure. Now they don't have video, so we have a graphic instead of where I would normally put video and then we have the audio file. So I'm going to show you guys how to do this. Um, I figured I'm already in here working, so I might as well show you how to set this up and make sure that you get the series, the speaker, and the date all set up. So let's dive in here and show you how it's done. So we're going to go to pages. We're going to go down the sermons. Now this is going to give us our whole list of all of our sermons. And this page, you can't see it here, but it's set to show um, 20 of the most recent sermons. So once you get past that, you're going to have pagination come here at the bottom that's going to help make this page not, um, not have so many at once. But let's dive in here. So here's all, of our, here's all of our messages. We're going to go to plus. And we're actually going to go add add a new post. So here what we we have this new series here called Fixing Backwards. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to say Fixing Backwards. And let's see, this one has one, two, it looks like it's got week one, week three. Uh, so let's say it's got, it looks like it's got, we'll start with part one here. So we're going to get that in place. Now you know this date is just today's date, but we're going to go change that here in just a minute. So the first thing we want to do is, now if I, if, if I was had a video, I would drop in a video link right here. And then I would take my URL and I would actually pull it right here. Um, I'm actually going to show you that real quick because there's one trick to it. Let's go over here to uh, YouTube. Uh, okay, let's grab this right here now if i just go if you manage a team uh, you good old ad i love it <laughs> now i'm gonna skip this ad obviously let's see oh, we got this nice relaxing music so if i go over here and i do share i'm gonna get this quick link now in this example it may work fine we're gonna throw this in here okay so that works pretty good, but you can see how it's making it large. So in a lot of you know, video formats, it's gonna be 16 by nine. So this is not gonna, gonna be so great for us. <laughs> let's turn this off. Uh, let's see, so what I wanna do is I actually wanna go to share and I wanna do embed. And I wanna grab this code right here, copy, come back over. And now I want to see this little code thing. So let's get rid of this. We don't need this anymore. And we're actually going to click on this code and we're going to drop in that code. We're going to do set. Now watch this. See how now it's the right format, the right sizing. So we're going to apply that. Now if I had a thumbnail, so let's say um, I want to add, oh, let's see, fixing backwards, this one right here. Let's see if we can move this up some so I can drag this over. I'm going to drop that right in place. It's going to create a custom thumbnail, so it's going to override this. All right, so there we go. So now we're actually, we're all set. Um, we can hit apply, and we have that. So now, um, if we don't have that, and we just want to drop in an image, that's, that's simple as well. We can just come here. Um, we can just, again, drag our image right here. So if we just have audio, sometimes it's nice to still have this nice, large image um, up front and you'll see how that drops so yeah so we have that we'll go ahead we already have video so we don't we don't need that actually on this post so I'm gonna go ahead and remove that and just have the the title graphic now I want to get in the audio so I'm gonna actually grab the audio block now there's no file right here yet so I'm gonna come in here drag week one uh, just like I did the image now this may take a while, so while it's doing that, I'm gonna come down here and I'm gonna give it um, a title. You'll notice a lot of times you're just kind of putting that title in different places so it, so it fills out the page. So here you can see it's updating 
I'm on this audio block. And then, you know, for this, I'm going to do uh, Cornell Jordan, that's pastor of Metro Assembly of God Church. And then the last thing I do here, there's podcasting settings you can go change if you want to hook this up to podcast services. Um, but the last thing I do is I want to say show the download link. So if I click this, that pops this link right here and that lets your um, visitor be able to actually download it to their computer um, instead of trying to keep in their browser tab open to listen to the sermon all the way through. So we have that. That is going to take a little bit of time, so we'll wait. And we're back. If you can believe it, we now have it downloaded and it shows right here. So we'll hit apply. All right, so now everything here is good to go. Now, so what we want to do is, last step, we want to go up here to this gear icon and we have to set all of our metadata, the kind of the behind the scenes connectors here. So uh, we have a status. So we have this as draft. Now this is where we're going to set our publish date. So we're going to hit publish. Now you'll see that it shows the 25th. Um, so I'm just going to, I would go to the 21st, but I already have a video from the 21st. So I'm actually, I am sorry, from the 20th. Um, because that would be the Sunday that most likely this video would have been produced. Um, but just for today, I'm going to show you the 21st, so it'll pop up above the one that I already have um, set. So we're going to put this there. We'll pretend that's the most recent Sunday. Um, okay, now we're going to go back. Now we're going to say tags. So tags is where we're going to actually have our speakers. So right now, um, we just have Pastor Cornell. So. Um, that's there. Now categories, this is where we're going to have all of our sermon series. So we haven't had one yet. If, if you already have some you're working on, then it'll auto-populate and you can just select it. But this is actually going to be brand new. Fixing backwards. All right. So then we're going to, oh yep, you have to hit enter or return. And then you want to click it one more time and get that check now you're good to go there so we got all that set up it's two more steps well a couple more uh, we want to then add our video again here so what this does is this is it says thumbnail image now on the grid of all the sermons it's this gonna pick up this image and show it right there in that grid to give it a nice presentation now, what I want to do here is I want the URL. That's what's going to show in your browser tab. So it'll be yourchurch.com slash uh, sermon slash uh, whatever you want to title it. So we're actually going to say fixing backwards part one. All right. And then the last piece is SEO, which is search engine optimization. So it's kind of like the URL, but it's like what? the people see when they come to this site in the Google like snippet right here. So we're again, we're going to put the same thing, fixing backwards. Then I would say part one. All right, so we have all of that. We're going to hit save. Now notice like it didn't update everything yet, but if I hit done, I hit save here. You'll see it's at the top. Now you'll see before we go back to the home, you have fixing backwards, you have it automatically pulled in the published date, which would have been that past Sunday. It's going to do the category. All this is good. And then Cordell Jordan, the pastor, is listed right here. And then it always sets up a handy um, next, next sermon. And I'm so incredibly excited about this series. It so was staring see, in my heart like for about super cool how easy it is to set this up and then when I go back to sermons and we want to go when this loads here we'll go we'll go full full width so you can get a good shot of it so now you see everything's in here and now my series has been added my speaker there's 16 in here right now and the date it's going to do it by month a nice little quick grouping for um, visitors to find the sermons they're looking for so I hope this helped a uh, quick way, if you have bold church template or the simple church template, they work like exactly like this. So you can follow this for every single 
um, sermon that you upload each week. So hope that helped. Thanks.